Hey everyone, this is Ryan Wade with UniqueApps.com. Today's app review is going to cover the free app, iBowl. So iBowl, again, is a free iPhone application. Pretty cool application, especially for being free. I give you the instructions right here when you first start. The instructions actually um, go away pretty quickly, which is good after you play this game mo um, more. But if you're just starting first off, um, you go back to Help and Options, and you can see the instructions by clicking here again. Bring up the instructions, really easy instructions. I'm not going to read those because they're, they're pretty self-explanatory once you start bowling or once you see. Um, there's not a lot, again, to this gameplay. There's really, um, you can see high scores, help and options, more games, challenge, and play. I'm going to go to play first and just show you how the game is played. you got three different levels to pick from. Or really not levels, three different bowling alleys. And I think those are all, yeah, it's only three right now. So um, I'm going to just click this first one right here. And basically the game um, is to, you can set the, the ball wherever you want by dragging it right here. I usually put it about right here. Right here. And you just hold this ball and you and you flick, flick the iPhone like this. Or you hold this button and you flick the iPhone and let it go at the same time. So I'm going to hold it. Oops. It's hard to do this while I'm videotaping. <laughs> there it goes. Um, that was actually a really crappy <laughs> throw, obviously. Um, but knocked down a few pins, so they'll tell you how you hit eight pins. You can also see up in the top um, which pins are yeah, which pins are still standing, and then also your standing score. You can see I'm on the first frame right there, and I just knocked eight down down eight pins. I'll try to throw this one a little bit better, but again, it's hard when I'm recording, so. Hold this. Oh, that was a little bit faster. Not really. Again, it's a, <laughs> actually that was probably slower than the first one. Again, it's um it's a little bit easier when you're not holding a video camera to to or not doing this in a video camera to um, play this game. And again, you you throw it just like you would a bowling ball. Although I would um, suggest too when you're doing this, be sure to hold on to your iPhone because I've. I've noticed a couple times when I'm using this, I've almost thrown my iPhone um, trying to get this ball to go faster. So be sure to really hold on to your iPhone um, when you're using this. So that's really how the game is playing. You go through 10 frames. I want to show you something pretty cool. Um, I want to go to exit game right here. I just, for those of y'all that didn't see, I just hit the pause button right here. That's how you get back to the main menu. Um, I can choose a different ball actually, and I forgot to show you that. Um, you can choose a different ball. I don't think these balls matter any. They're just colors. They're not really weighted. They're just they're just different colors. So um, I'm gonna go to exit game though because I want to show you a really cool. Oh, and the application just died on me. Um, let me start that up really quick. Again, this is a free app. I'm not really worried about. It. There are a couple um, kinks to the app, but um, I want to show you actually really cool. You can go to challenge right here in the middle, and you can actually play people in real time. Um, you can do a turn-based challenge to where um, in real time you just go from turn to turn, you wait for your turn and then you go, or you can actually do a real time challenge. Um, and I've just got my name in there as T. I just typed a letter just, just for quickness. You can go to a random match or to a competition. Um, I don't really actually know the difference between these two. They, they seem the same to me, so I'm just gonna go to competition. And I'll actually show you really quick. Um, this will just, um, you can, oh, that's that's actually <laughs> what, what the difference is. You actually can select which one. So these are the games that are being played right now. Or if I go back to random match, it'll just put me in a game. So the difference between random match and comp competition is competition, you get to select which room to join. So it's loading right now. And um, wait till it picks a match. Might have been better off just going to um, competition. Do that, and I'll just select one. We'll go to Jake right here. Again, these are people um, that are playing real time and that their scores are showing. I'm going to click on join, or I can also create a booth. So, waiting for the host to start. Again, since this is real time, it kind of lags a little bit because, okay, competition canceled. We'll try to join another one join Sam right here oops I don't want to create a booth go to up oh, Sam's full so let's go to Roberto go to join Roberto waiting for the host to start 
so I apologize that we're waiting for a while. I'm just trying. I guess he's waiting on other players. Here comes those other players. I feel kind of bad though because I'm just gonna cancel this <laughs> whenever I show you what what happens. So um, he should start the competition pretty soon. Again, we're waiting on it. And again, this is I apologize, but this is actually real time that I'm going through this. So so we gotta wait on these guys to start. I'm actually gonna pause the video right here. And um, I will begin recording whenever it starts, whenever the competition starts. Okay, so I just finally joined the competition, and I'll show you what happens. I'm just going to bowl this really quick. Um, again, sorry for... <laughs> the balls actually go a lot quicker, but it's really hard because I'm in between. Um, I'm trying to videotape this, so... It's a little bit harder for me to throw. Again, I'm not trying to get any score. I just want to show you what happens in the competition mode. So you see I just scored an 8. So after this, it will actually show me the scores of everybody else now that's playing in this in this competition. So you can see Bob. I don't know if you can read this. Bob already has. Um, looks like he got a strike. Uh, Ray, man, he's already got a strike on every single frame so far. Um, End Dog has a spare. And then I've got an 8 right here at the bottom. So it's actually really cool. Again, you see in real time, and you compete. Um, you can only compete with up to four people, but it's kind of cool, especially for being a free app, that you can compete on real time um, with people around the world that are actually playing this game right now. So that's really the. Um, I'm going to exit out of this. That's really the um, the iBowl, the free iBowl app on iTunes. I give this probably a four, or. Yeah, three and a half out of five stars. Um, there's the gameplay isn't the greatest, but again, it's a free app, and it's also really cool that you can challenge people um, from around the world. So again, three and a half out of five stars. I hope you enjoyed the review of iBowl for the iPhone. And um, again, this is Ryan with UniqueApps.com. Please subscribe to my channel for more app reviews. Have a great day.